It's a lightweight bout between Khabib Nurmagomedov and Raging Al Iaquinta. Here you go, first one, you ready? You ready? Let's All right, go. so here we go with this highly anticipated stand-up only event. You gotta play by the rules here. There aren't a ton of them, but there is no grappling of any type, either on the field or on the ground. Fighters cannot do follow-up strikes on the floor as well, so that bears watching here as round one gets underway. Nice punch by Raging Ally Quint. They have started this fight off with a brawl. Oh, man, with that right leg kick. Steps forward with his right leg. Now he's in southpaw. Here's a nice straight right hand. That one hurt. Nice body shot. And he eats a kick. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Doing a very good job of parrying and blocking all the shots that are coming towards his head. And he connects with the punch there. Oh, beautiful kick to the body there. And he just left himself wide open for that strike. Very vulnerable by leaning in, keeping the guard high to allow for an opening down low. Doing an excellent job of mixing up his strikes here. Ayaquinta's kick, that one blocked. Nurmagomedov gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. And he lands the roundhouse. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, that's a good knee to the body there by Nurmagomedov. And he lands a very nice combination. Front kick to the face. Nurmagomedov gets hit with that overhand. Very nice timing with the shots here. Nurmagomedov gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Blocks the shot. Well, he lands another jab, really employing the jab effectively here. And he gets hit with an outside leg kick. Three minutes remain in the round. And there's a nice kick. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Raging Ally of Clinton. And there's a nice straight right. Man, these are really starting to pile up. Oh! Kicked him in the face! This could be it! These are some bombs he has thrown. And now starting to snap off that jab. Very nice. And he connects there. Hard leg kick. Lands a powerful kick. Beautiful body, body shot. shot there, too. Nice leg kick. Oh! This could be it right here. He's down. Woo! Woo! Look at that jab. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Couldn't agree with you more. Ayaquinta gets caught by the inside leg kick. Nice punch. Lands an outside leg kick of his own. Working out of that southpaw stance. How about that chin? Well, still plenty of time to go here in round one, but maybe to the surprise of his opponent, he has come out so aggressive here tonight, he has landed a ton of strikes here early and gotten off to a nice start. Inside leg kick is there by Nurmagomedov. Just misses with the straight right. Blocks the strike. Punch coming, it's blocked. Also, he gets clipped once again here, Joe, and he continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's keeping his head on the center line. He's got to change things up a little bit here. Straight to the body by Nurmagomedov. His leg appears to be hurt here, Joe. You can visibly see him starting to limp. Nice inside leg kick. Clean with the right hook. 
There's the leg kick. That one checked by Aya Kruger. Nice shot. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Mago Menov gets hit with that overhand. Back and forth we go. There, huge block for him. The horn sounds for the end of round one. Here's a body kick. Really excellent striking being displayed in that round. Here we go, second round, you ready? You ready? Here we are, early round two. Starting off this round, you've got to think he's probably still hurt from that last round. He's going to want to move and avoid taking damage early. Habib Nurmagomedov is one of the best grapplers in MMA. He has knockout power in his strikes, and his big skill is being able to take guys down and maul them on the ground. Oh, and he ate a front kick. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Nermago Meta. Visibly limping here. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbows. Well, that has been the pattern in this one. Punches and bunches, volume, output activity have been the buzzwords, and there are the numbers to back it up as we show you the total strikes landed. This has been a one-sided clash thus far. Yep. Well, straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. Oh, slips the punch there, Joe. Good combination. Beautiful right hand. Well, he's landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of there. Oh, how about the output for this fighter here? A lot of good time shots there, and they're all landing. Very nice leg kick for him there. Can't take too many of those. Right back to the jab and snaps the head back yet again. That's a nice clean shot. Oh, right left combo by Nermago Meadow. Knee to the liver. He's hurt bad. He's trying to stay up. He is in big, big trouble. Oh, head kick. Oh, oh he nailed him. He's trying to stay up. Big knee to the body. And he che he's checking every single one of those. He caught that one right on the knee. That could have hurt. Oh, oh huge right hand. hand! He's got to be careful here. He's in trouble. Vicious knees. Another nice knee. And he switches his stance yet again. Oh, he switches his stance again. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Ayaquinta gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Near the body. Watch the shot here, Joe. with the punch. Oh, man, look how quickly he gets that foot to the target. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Oh, 
He's hurt to the body. You can tell that shot hurt him bad. Oh, vicious knee to the body. He's hurt. Oh. He's hurt. He's down. Oh, what a leg kick. Oh, oh beautiful combination. He got to go. Oh, that my is it. Goodness. Oh, my goodness. Perfectly placed knee for the KO. Yeah, Joe, that is an absolutely debilitating knee employed to get the stoppage victory here tonight. And, and oftentimes in MMA, it's more about precision and location than it is the push buffer has the official decision.